wide receiving court. Sitkowski off to a great start. He's three for his first four on a pitch play. Blackshear plants his foot, traces the seam, and is into the end zone for a Rutgers touchdown. I love the play design. They bring in the tight ends. And look at Tariq Hole, the left tackle. Great job out there in space. His coaching staff told us that Raheem Blackshear might have the best hands on the team. Hillman in the goal line situation pushes into the end zone for another Rutgers touchdown. 13-0. There, but it looked like they had two tight ends to the left. Play action. Sitkowski finds Blackshear, who finds the end zone for the second time. Rutgers up three scores. They love him as a receiver. You can see, I mean, he fakes the play action, just leaks out of the backfield. But Hillman is a good short yardage back, and he gets the call on third down, has the first down. How about a touchdown? Yes. Hillman's in there from eight yards out. And Rutgers goes up by 20. Hillman, 28 career touchdowns now. And a good job. Now his third penalty. And that's right through the hands of Vitt. He's in trouble in his own end zone. Is it going to be a safety or a touchdown? Touchdown, Rutgers. 03. Ola Kunle Fatukasi flopped on top of it. The sophomore from far Rockaway, New York. Watch the snap. I mean, it's a perfect snap. You know, maybe got a little mustard on it, but it goes right through his hands. He took his eyes off the ball. He did. He looked like he moved his head. Still see him in the game at this point? Well, I think it's great for him because he doesn't have any experience. So, Pacheco, hard runner, still on his feet, in the Texas State territory and nudged out of bounds. Here we get a little taste of what the coaches were telling us about how exciting this guy is. Just a simple little zone play to the right. And you can see him breaking tackles, broke a couple there. Here's the stiff arm. The bull in a China shot. <laughs> Snap throw here. And it's intercepted. Isaiah Wharton with a pick. The captain in the secondary has something to cheer about. And to fire that cannon soon as the Scarlet Knights are building on a drive, first and 10, deep in Buffalo territory. Around the edge and walking in. Touchdown, Raheem Blackshear. On this touchdown run by Blackshear, he cuts it back right behind Jonah Jackson. Nice blocking down the field as well by Shameen Jones. With the young secondary corners of Indiana. Something to track as those young receivers for Rutgers. Blackshear on the air with some space, and he cuts back. Raheem Blackshear all the way down inside the 25. And for a Rutgers team that has struggled to not get any big plays this season, that's a nice gain of 36. We're talking about gives them some confidence. Just a basic play, and they're blocking it pretty well. They outflank the Indiana defense, and we already talked about Raheem Blackshear. He's the best football player on offense. Third down and nine. For the end zone, and it's caught. Touchdown, Shameen Jones. It's the first wide receiver touchdown for Rutgers on the season. Rutgers, a good opening drive. They were two for two on third downs. There was also a big penalty on third down. And it all ends with a Shameen Jones touchdown grab. And a heavy dose of Stevie Scott here. This time he definitely lost it. And Rutgers picks it up. Deontay Roberts with a recovery. From the Indiana 45. Halfback pass. Halfback pass indeed. To check on to Jerome Washington. And Washington at 256 pounds rumbling his way down to the six-yard line. The end zone. See right here, he's got to gear down a little bit and he catches the ball, bobbles it for a second, but big. And make it maybe 31 to 7. Hilleman, second effort, he's in. Touchdown, Rutgers.
Rodgers turns that turnover into six points. Now important. Aiden Ramsey needs nine yards. He's going for everything. The end zone, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Damon Hayes, the junior safety. Then it takes a touchdown and a field goal to tie it. Ball is underthrown. Four out of the gun. Pressure. Ball loose. Mike Tabernoff got to the quarterback and he recovered the fumble. Got blocked. Wow. No doubt a fumble. Maybe not the first half that he was hoping for to this point. Pacheco, a lot of room. It's a foot race, and Pacheco goes the distance. A 44-yard touchdown. Yeah, you see, it's just a simple play, and you, you know, you got to credit two things, the line blocking and Pacheco, because there's a defender wide open right there in the hole, and he hardly touched it in 21. As we start to watch the clock here, Northwestern, all three timeouts, but Thorson is slung around and dropped, and it's a safety. Making plays. And Willington Prevalon, he just beat J.B. Butler and went right for Clayton Thorson. Thorson, he's going to take off. Fake the quick pass to the right, then he dropped the football. Rutgers claiming they have it. And they do have it. Come out and smash you in the mouth, push that line of scrimmage back. Play action, Hornybrook on the roll again. Third time he's rolled out to throw, floating this one for his tight end, and it's intercepted. Saquon Hampton with his first pick of the year. Four man pressure for the Badgers. Sitkowski with time looking, finds Blackshear who breaks free. Blackshear inside the 15 and lowers the pads to the 10. Three more after the catch. And a nice throw by Art Sikowski, putting it on the upfield shoulder of Blackshear. Rutgers with an opportunity to strike down at the nine-yard line. Sikowski with pressure coming. Has time. Sikowski fights Blackshear for a first down at the 30. Blackshear with a spin down the sideline, and it's first and goal Rutgers. As Blackshear finally knocked out at the seven by Rashad Wild Goose. Just always talk about how number two is a real one. He is the one guy on this Rutgers offense that's a playmaker, a difference maker. And the more they use him at wide receiver, the Knights down three touchdowns. Sitkowski, the give to Hilleman. Hilleman in for a Rutgers touchdown. Watching for his kids. Yeah, it is, and it just kind of shows that if you do the little things that I've been asking you to do, third and two at the 46. Sitkowski on the screen again to Blackshear. Got a block and a first down. Blackshear into space. Raheem Blackshear caught from behind inside the 15 at the 14 by Madison Cohn, but another big play on a screen for Rutgers. And Raheem Blackshear does a nice job putting his foot to the ground and cutting back. They're making two Badgers timeout, miss. Injury. injury timeout. And Madison Cohn was slow to cheer the running back. And on fourth down, Sitkowski throws Blackshear with the catch, and it's a touchdown. Eighth catch of the day for Raheem Blackshear. Just runs a roll pass. Everyone on the O-line goes to the left. The back leaks out to the right. And the reversing out by Sikowski. Take care of business in Indy. He'll definitely in terms of the Big Ten in the playoff. Some room for Pacheco. And Pacheco's got good speed. Pacheco feeling back to the 30-yard line. A big one for Pacheco. Inside the five, it's a touchdown. This is at full speed. And that's plenty of speed. Again, this is the fastest defense that Don Brown's ever dealt with. Keep an eye on K.J. Hamler, the outstanding slot receiver for Penn State. He's streaking up the middle right now. McSorley throws in the direction of Cam Sullivan Brown. Make that Justin Shorter, and it is picked off by Isaiah Wharton. Remember, Rutgers was denied at the one-yard line earlier in this half. Blackshear stretches for the goal line 
and he breaks the plane. Rutgers is on the board. Well, Chris, they couldn't punch it in the last time they were down there, but nice effort here by Blackshear, stretching out, getting the ball across the plane. He had a guy in the backfield to pace in terms of wins. And a lot of other categories, we might add. There's quite a few quarterbacks that, that come to mind. I played with Kevin Thompson when I was a rookie in Cleveland. Sanders lost the football, and it looked like Saquon Hampton kept it inbounds and recovers it for Rutgers. You mentioned it. Hanashuk and Williams have been a staple inside. Now Rashino going for the end oh. zone. What a pass. What a catch. Touchdown, Rutgers. Travis Vokalek, the softball. All day, but he gets time up front. But he sets his feet. That's a throw that, that's only the fifth touchdown pass. 30-yarder for Matt Coughlin, who scored all of Michigan State's points the last two weeks. Oh, man. He lost his footing, and this is Lewerke, normally the quarterback, and he's going to throw an interception. Trevor Morris picks it. And Trevor Morris returns it out around the 35-yard line, and Chris Ash is fired up. Oh, yeah. It starts with the hold by Lewerke, just drops it. Just mishandles it. Now it's... This is just an automatic, a fire drill right now. Maybe that's why Brian Lewerke's not playing today. That shoulder is just, he can't get anything on the football. Yeah, he injured but, his shoulder against Penn State, well under throw. But heads up by Trevor Moore, 14 degrees when I left my house yesterday morning. Second down at 11. Mid 40s here today and missed all afternoon. And that pass is, is it intercepted by Hampton? No, they're going to say incomplete.